In the grand theater of maritime history, two colossal vessels stand as iconic bookends. The RMS Titanic, a symbol of early 20th century opulence, meets the wonder of the seas, a marvel of the 21st century. Let's embark on a voyage through time as we compare these two maritime giants. The RMS Titanic, a British passenger liner, was a feat of engineering and luxury when it set sail in 1912. Fast forward to the present day, and we have the wonder of the seas, a Royal Caribbean international cruise ship. It's a state-of-the-art vessel. The Titanic boasted a length of 882 feet and a 92.5 feet height. It sailed at a top speed of 23 knots and had a range of approximately 2,400 nautical miles. While the Wonder of the Sea measures 1,188 feet in length and 210 feet in height, it cruises at 22 knots and has a range over 7,500 nautical miles. Designed to carry about 2,400 passengers and 900 crew members, the Titanic had certainly earned its name and its time. But as of today, the Wonders of the Seas provide spacious accommodations for well over 6,000 passengers and 2,400 crew members. Speaking of accommodations, let's talk about the different purposes these two ships were created for. The Wonders of the Seas is a cruise ship, while the Titanic an ocean liner. You board a cruise ship to have fun and an ocean liner to get somewhere. The Titanic took three years to build in Belfast, Northern Ireland. The hull of the Titanic was made up of thousands of overlapping plates. This was done to protect the Titanic from damage caused by scraping against the seabed. In contrast, the Wonder of the Seas was built in pieces all around the world, showcasing the globalization of the shipbuilding industry. It took years to create this modern masterpiece. Ships of today are still made from steel, but advancements have resulted in hulls stronger and less brittle. Aluminum is also widely used to reduce the ship's weight. Speaking of the engines, modern cruise ships run primarily on either diesel, natural gas, or some combination of the two. This is a far cry from ships of the Titanic's era, which used coal furnaces to boil the water powering its steam engines. On board Wonder of the Seas, guests can enjoy an extensive water park, four swimming pools, an outdoor theater, 20 restaurants and 19 lounges and bars. Titanic had a squash court, deck games like shuffleboard, four restaurants and one swimming pool. Titanic had 20 lifeboats on board, enough to evacuate most of the people on board when the ship sank. While Wonder of the Seas only has 18 lifeboats, these are much larger and can accommodate every person on the ship. So would you be ready to sail the Wonder of the Seas, a state-of-the-art vessel? Thanks for watching the video till the end.